All right, so welcome YouTube. Today I'm gonna be making and reviewing Reese's Cookie Skillet Kit, as you guys see here. So um, I'll cut to the making part now. All right, so for our Reese's Cookie Skillet Kit, our preparation is to preheat oven to 350 degrees Fahrenheit. Combine Reese's cookie mix with Reese's peanut butter chips in a bowl. Add a tablespoon of egg, beaten in a tablespoon of soft of softened butter. Mix until completely blended. So then we have to butter the cast iron skillet. Then bake for eight to ten minutes or until edges are done. So let's get into this. I don't know if the Reese's, um, what was it, peanut butter chips are in this packaging or not. But we'll see whenever I open this up. Oh good, it is in there because I didn't have any. And oh wait, I forgot to clean a bowl so I can beat the egg. So I'll come back whenever I get the bowl cleaned. Alright, so now let's get our egg cracked. Alright, so let's get our butter measured out here. The measurement things on the on the wrapper isn't aligned with the stick so what I'm going to do is to realign the stick with the measurements so it's easier on me right, so let's get a real tiny amount of butter out for the cast iron skillet so we can get so we can get it buttered up so what I'm going to do now while I am I'm gonna well before I mix the ingredients up is to get this buttered up <laughs> So that seems about like a tablespoon to me, so let's set that aside and get this mixed up. Of having the excess now I'm just going to leave a little bit, a little bit of the butter on. So let's do that. There the handle isn't really that bad. So let's get the batter scraped up into there, into the skillet. And let's get it, try to get it evenly pressed. Alright, so that's probably about even. So what I'm going to do now is to put this... Okay, I didn't know there was already other things in there, so... I'm going to take them, those items out before I put my skillet, my tiny skillet in there. Well, not used to cast like people storing stuff inside. All right, so let's keep that there. Now we'll deal with it later. So let's get our skillet in. All right, so now. It's like, I think it said like five to eight minutes or so. Maybe it was six to eight. I'll double check. 
Long side. Uh, eight to ten minutes. So in the meantime, I'm gonna clean up my um, stage, my prep station here. And I'll see you guys when I go to review it. Alright, so our Reese's cookie thing has been in here for 10 minutes. Now, to me, it doesn't really look like it's fully baked. Maybe it said it, the packaging did say to let it cool down completely, so maybe I just have to leave it out till it cools completely so hopefully this didn't flop out on me all right so youtube here's the racy skillet cookie now it is very soft for a cookie so let's review it now Alright, so it has a nice peanut butter flavor to it. Um, it's also very soft, like I had mentioned earlier. Overall, it's not bad, and I would consider making it again. Besides, like, I'd probably, once I hoard up enough cookie skillets, I'll probably donate it to Goodwill, because I'm sure there's someone that could use it for like an individual egg or even give it to family members or friends so i hope you guys enjoyed the video and see you guys in the next one